every day, these men leave their homes and families to ensure Nigerians are secured. Sometimes, some are lucky to come back home. Other times, some fall to the bullets of men of the underworld, leaving behind their families. At this program, the wife of the general inspector of police will be meeting with these women that hold the home front, while widows will be introduced to health insurance, scholarships will be awarded to their children. The widow, as we know, loses their health insurance benefit with the untimely demise of their husband, making access to health care unduly costly for them. The introduction of the health insurance program for widows will alleviate the difficulties encountered in having access to affordable health care. The governor described the police officer's wife's contribution as invaluable. So this event is a testament to all the good works and the commitment that all police officers' wives are doing in their families in keeping peace in Nigeria. Handing over the health insurance scheme to the withers and scholarships to 10 officers' children, the President Police Officers' Wives Association encouraged them to be strong for their children. As a mother who is interested in boosting the standard of living of individuals and educational development for our children. I am elected to present this scholarship and insurance benefit to all the beneficiaries. This award symbolizes our deep appreciation and unwavering support for the families who stand behind our brave officers. It is our second official visit to Lagos Command since our husband became the General Inspector of Police. Also, at this program, the police officer's wives called on Nigerians to be patient and show more understanding with their husbands as they carry out their statutory responsibility. Esora Usemege, reporting for BTV News.